What up, folks? Team Boots here, and I thought I'd check out this Alfred Hitchcock figure just because I bought it like at least over a year ago. So it's been quite a while, and I think the reason I didn't review it is because I had nothing to review it on because my house is broken into. Um, and uh, at least was it two Thanksgivings ago, maybe or something like that. But uh, but yeah, it was, it was I don't know, it was a while back. But anyways. I've been wanting to review this figure. I've never opened him up. I plan on opening him up. I just never could figure out what I wanted to do as far as like the goofing off or taking a toy photo and stuff like that. And then I realized too, also just going to the reaction figure uh, fan group page um, that or reaction figure fans that I have so many holes in my um, collection and stuff as far as Super Seven figures go or reaction figures, and it's kind of it's I don't know, it's crazy. I I don't know. Hopefully someday I can start picking up some more figures, but I think with this idea that I had tonight for a goofy fun photo that I might be able to. And um another big struggle too is uh getting this <laughs> getting this um house organized and getting my collection organized. But yeah, with that said, Alfred Hitchcock, the master of suspense, is one of the most revered and recognizable directors in film history through his classic films Psycho, The Birds, Rear Window, and Vertigo. Along with his classic television show, Alfred Hitchcock Presents, which I do remember, Hitchcock has gripped the imaginations of, and minds of generations with his filmmaking artistry. Which, I will say, The Birds, I have seen that movie. I saw that movie when I was a kid. Um, I can't remember. I think I saw it on black and white TV, too. Like, like a long time ago. It might have been TV I had in my room to play Nintendo back in the day, because I actually had a black and white TV. Um like some of us might have and some might not have but um but yeah that was a cool movie i thought it was pretty crazy there's like two old school movies that i can think of that kind of had like made an impression on me the birds was one of them and another one that doesn't even involve hitchcock and uh was uh playing misty for me that had um ah oh, the lady from arrested development and clint eastwood thought that movie was really really dark and crazy and kind of like as far as like a just just kind of dark suspense whatever kind of thriller thing maybe or whatever but yeah those old school movies like that kind of really made an impression on me as far as uh, just good films and stuff from back in the day but yeah without any further ado let's check this figure out yeah this is a cool figure i, I love the sculpt he's got the iconic look with the jowls and everything. And he's got a cool little stoke. So very sophisticated figure. I dig him. And he's kind of like a mid-sized figure. He's not very tall. Like, let me see. Yeah, there we go. As far as size comparison. Well, actually, yeah, that's about, uh, about standard uh, Star Wars figure size. I don't think I have any other figures available on me right now. Except for, yeah. Charlie Sheen but yeah he's actually I don't know I don't know if they scaled that right or not because I don't know his actual real height but yeah there you go but either way cool figure I love him and he's gonna serve a purpose tonight which will be cool but I thought I'd review him because there's quite a few man his head doesn't want to turn but I don't want to force it but um yeah it's a figure I haven't reviewed and always wanted to and just figure I needed to do it. And it's also cool because it comes with a little crow. So that's pretty rad. And it's pretty funny too because um, the movie The Birds, there's a scene where the kids are trying to leave school or whatever. And uh, and there's this whole flock of birds, so like crows, like sitting on the monkey bars and stuff. And the teacher's like, come on, we're all going to run out of here. Everybody go, you know, and but it just like run haul it you know <laughs> and the birds start attacking the kids and stuff and um it's crazy because uh it's weird it's I'd, I'd, I'd really like to see how they did it because i guess it's like before like green screen and all that so they had to i guess animate those birds in somewhat and then have like fake dummy puppet birds like attacking the kids and stuff like that too so it's kind of funny but for that time i guess it's pretty dark and pretty gnarly so yeah very cool movie. I wouldn't mind seeing it again. I'd really want to see Vertigo. I've never seen that one. Um, I know Psycho, but I don't think I've ever seen the original. And um, I was watching that one television show like a couple of years ago. What was it called? Jeez. But it was based on that. Anyways, this is a cool figure. And 
If you can find him, I guess he's, I'm not sure what he goes for on secondary market, but I know there's a blood splattered version too. But yeah, because sometimes uh, reaction figure variants can go for quite a bit of money. But anyways, uh, thanks for watching y'all. And uh, pretty soon some uh, more, um, I guess there's a drop. There was a Transformers, well, I guess it's a wave two drop. Should be reviewing that pretty soon. And then there's the Army of Darkness drop next week. So that's going to be cool. Hopefully if I get that, I'll review that too because they are awesome. Anyways, thanks for watching y'all and have a good one. All right, later.